I know my mind has stopped working. There is a limit to brain's ability, isn't it? <laughs> That's such a misconception. Brain's ability is limitless. It's a muscle that you can strengthen like any other muscle of your body. You can rewire it to boost its power. Our brain power can increase as much as we want it to be. So that's what we are going to discuss today. Simple ways by which we can increase our brain power. The grid of our brain lowers down very frequently because we are tired, we are stressed throughout the day, but you can always turn this grid up so that your brain is functioning well it also helps in reducing your daily stress and most importantly to reduce the decline of your thought process of your cognitive functions that happens with age so let's talk about those very simple techniques by which you can do this known as neuroplasticity exercises you can check out my video on neuroplasticity and it doesn't only apply to people who have an illness or injury and want their brain to function in a different way now but it applies to every person the cells in our brain regenerate on a daily basis we just need to give it a nudge i pride myself in the idea that my brain's ability is good i'm not really exaggerating because i used to play video games a lot of video games as a child Video games do help you to increase your brain power. You know what else helps boost your brain power? Learning a new language. It's research that tells you that multilingual people actually have better brain ability compared to people who just stay on one path, learn just one language throughout their life and use it throughout. Not necessarily that, but also try to learn new words every day, improve on your vocabulary, and also you can try to do puzzles. All of these help to increase your brain power. I used to play keyboard as a child a lot. And if you try to make music with it, it's really going to improve your creativity, your new learning. You'll become skilled with it, really proficient at how your fingers will work. So how much it will do for your coordination? Think about it. So making music is good, but even if you're not really interested in playing instruments, regularly listening to music, depending on how your mood is or what kind of music you are really interested in, helps to also to boost your brain power. Interestingly, travel is also a way of boosting your brain power. It's going to get you to be more social, improve your learning of ideas about new places, what they're equipped with, what wonderful places are there to visit in the world. But even if you cannot travel that frequently, you can always try to implement in your daily life, like try to take a new route to go to a place sometimes, or try to go to a different grocery store that you usually go to, so even that helps. I don't think anybody really needs to tell you that exercise is also a very good way to boost your brain power. Why? It works on your muscles, your brain, your endurance overall also increases. So it's a wonderful thing. The blood flow throughout your body also boosts up. So everything becomes good with exercise. Are you artistic? We already talked about music. So if you're artistic, draw, color, paint, whatever you like. And don't necessarily try to copy something, but try to make anything out of your imagination. What if the drawing is bad? Doesn't matter. It's for yourself. You can always draw it. So your mood will also lighten with that. You will project all your feelings, all your emotions into those pictures. There is one more thing that you need to do, which is called feeding your brain. You know, whatever we eat, at least 25% of that actually goes into our brain. Our brain uses so much of it if you try to use the wrong side or the non-dominant side of your body sometimes for writing or any of your daily tasks new connections are formed in your brain a very good connectivity is there new pathways are developed and they actually help to boost your brain power also then try doing some kind of new skill some kind of new thing that you would like to do like all always wanted to juggle I was able to get to the level of two, but when I tried to make it three, it became a disaster for me. So whatever skill you like to do, bouncing balls or even playing chess 
all of these new skills are going to boost your brain power. Try doing this at home. Tie a cloth around your eyes, maybe on a holiday, and try to do your usual routine tasks in your own house where you are aware of where everything is without using your vision. You will realize that we rely so much on our vision that we do not try to use our other senses. Sound, touch, smell, these things affect our daily life so much. And always take time out for physically socializing with people. Try to leave technology behind. So for example, if you want to go for a walk, what you can do is leave your phone behind. What people think is, no, in case if there is an emergency, what will we do? Trust me, 20 years back when technology was less, people did not carry phones that often. It still was okay. You could not use technology and yet go out and feel free to enjoy nature, to enjoy talking to people. You know, people are so busy on their phones, they don't even care to smile at the person standing next to them. That's how bad social skills have become for people. Too busy in technology. So leave it behind and try to socialize physically more. You know what I always do when I finish a YouTube video? I congratulate myself, pat myself on the back. Always congratulate yourself at the end of the day. Don't count how stressed the day was. Try to count what good things you accomplished for that day. It really will help to boost your brain power and make you more confident in your life. So try to use any number of these techniques for yourself and try to tell them to others. Also spread the word because this is a need of the day. Everybody has a very good potential. It's just a matter of boosting it, trying to get it to the right level. And leave a comment about what you felt about this video. Would you have any suggestions for me for this and any other videos that you might like to watch in the road to rehab? Leave a like, subscribe to the channel. It helps to grow my channel also. And we will meet again.